In other headlines, a rail operator SMRT says it is reviewing waiting times on the Circle Line. Trains currently arrive every seven minutes. But with the line now fully operational, the number of commuters is expected to rise at least 30% at key stations like Buena Vista. Our reporter sussed out the situation during Monday morning peak hour. It's the first working day since the final 12 stations of the Circle Line opened on Saturday. The line lets commuters avoid busy interchanges like City Hall and Raffles Place, allowing them to beat the Monday blues. For North Sound Line, basically you couldn't squeeze in and then um, you need to wait for two or three rounds. Usually I will change at Queenstown for, for a shuttle bus, company shuttle bus that will take me to Botanic Gardens. With the Circle Line, um, I'm trying out the route, yeah, see whether it shortens my journey. With this line now, I save 10 minutes and beside that, uh, my son is taking the train to uh, Holland V and that is where we try work halfway together, we have some quality time together, that is good. The trains were noticeably less crowded than those on other lines, but SMRT expects overall traffic to swell by 30 to 40 percent once commuters get familiar with the new route. Now that the Circle Line is fully operational, ridership during the morning rush hours expected to go up. And that's why train waiting times between One North and Paya Lebar stations have been shortened to just three and a half minutes. The route will take you through Bonavista, Bishan, Serangoon and Paya Lebar interchange stations where passenger traffic is likely to be highest. About 400,000 people are soon expected to use the Circle Line every day, up from 200,000 previously. SMRT says this justifies an increase in train frequencies from one every seven minutes to one every five or six minutes during off-peak hours. It depends on, on where is the, 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 the peak load. We can't really extend to all the circle line station. We need to optimise optimize our resources. With the circle line, places that were previously hard to reach are now easily accessible. The National University Hospital, for instance, now has Kent Ridge Station as its doorstep. So from November, the shuttle service between the hospital and Dover MRT station will cease. After the break, floods...